here we are. The uh, uh, windows. I told you I started about 2005. I bought an investment property, and they uh, they have these old windows in it. And where I come from, we you know we save things. And so when I started saving the windows, I didn't think of it as saving the windows. I was just working on them, you know. And people came by and they said, "Why don't you just replace them?" Well, it's like, well, it didn't even occur to me that you could, you know. And apparently, by the time you know I, I got out of college and I started this business, this whole replacement craze had taken place. And I'll tell you this: little about the replacement industry. What one of their goals is, and I've got them quoted as saying this. Their goal is to get the general public to think of windows like appliances to be changed every seven to ten years. Okay, and let me show you why. Okay, the uh, the, the Tampa Bay area where we live. Is this is this still considered Tampa Bay? Kind of side of the outskirts. Okay, Tampa Bay area area. There's eighty thousand buildings with this type of window. Okay. 80,000 windows, and would you say that it would, uh, a fair uh, average number would be 20 windows per building? Right? Okay, 21 windows per building, okay? Someone want to get the calculator? <laughs> How many windows is that? 1.6 million, right? Okay. Some money, let's, let's talk about what an average price for a window is. What's it? Would, would somebody pay, has, has somebody paid $1,000 for a window? Have you heard of that? Okay. Has somebody paid 100 bucks for a window? 500 Okay. Let's say, let's say an average price for a window, any kind of window work, okay, is $750. Say, okay, you go and you buy a replacement window at Home Depot and it costs, you three hundred dollars okay so you have to pay somebody to go and install it how much is that going to cost you you know hundred so you're at four hundred then you're going to have to trim it out and then you're going to have to paint it so that's the low end right so i put in i plug in a number of about 750 bucks okay because i think that we can all safely re reasonably expect that it could cost that much sometimes more sometimes less Okay, so let's multiply that times 750. Okay, $750 times 1.6 million, how much is that? What's that? $1.2 billion. Okay, that's $1.2 billion. $1.2 billion just in the Tampa Bay area in Windows. Okay, now. If I'm a businessman and I know there's 1.2 billion dollars out there, okay, and I want to go and get it, um, I've got a market, okay, and so let's think about a, what what a good marketing budget would be if I wanted to figure out how to get 1.2 million dollars. Uh, let's say 5% revenues is probably good to spend on marketing. 5% of um, 1.2 billion is 60 million, okay, which goes which really explains. How come there's just so much window replacement advertising out there? Because here's what, if they can convince you that the replacement window is an appliance to be replaced seven to ten, every seven to 10 years, then they've got this recurring cycle of income that just, you know, we become batteries, the houses become batteries to feed this industry, okay? And it's perfect, you know, it's perfectly understandable. You know what I'm saying? You know, and so, if they are collecting, you know, and cashing in on this $1.2 billion, you know, it's become my mission to cash in on it too, but in a different way, you know, is to restore these windows. And so, but I need help. I can't do it by myself because, you know, I used to work in Lakeland a lot, you know. Um, but you know what happens? You just get spread too thin. You know, it's just me. You know, and so the minute I start putting out any advertising, you know how hungry people are? The minute I start putting out any advertising, okay, I get so inundated with work, you know, that I just can't do it all. You know what I did this week? I, uh, I called up Scott Seidler, my buddy in Austin, you know, at Austin Home Restoration, or Austin Historical, 
And I gave him some of my leads I couldn't get to. You know, I just couldn't do it. You know, because the minute you put out any kind of advertising, you know, you just get inundated. That's what happened to Ann. You know, Ann, who got historic window rescue, she just passed out some flyers, and man, she can't, she, she can't look up. She's got so much work to do in the historic window arena. All right. So if you want a side hustle, all right, <laughs> a good money-making side hustle, you know, I can hook you up. I can show you how to do it. And you can be making easily in a year six figures, you know, very, you know, in a very small footprint, you know, because it, because look, check it out. This is what people need. Okay, they have this. This is this is their window. Okay, you see that right there? This is their window. This is your window, is it not? Yes. All right. This is your window, and you need somebody to work on this. Okay. Now, what kind of investment does it take to work on this?